Hi, welcome to another Power Blast podcast. Today we're going to talk about the top reasons why people love 80 Day Obsession. Stay tuned. Hey everyone, Perry Tinsley here, creator of the Power Blast podcast, and welcome to another show. I'm a health and fitness coach, and today we're going to talk about the new program that came out, oh gosh, when did that come out? Middle of January, I think, to the general public. Uh, it's called 80 Day Obsession, and I, I've i been doing that. I'm going to share some of my experience with you today, but uh, the inspiration for this podcast, or this episode, came when I was checking in on one of the people that I coach who had been doing this program, and she's been a part of my groups for maybe a few years, and to see her response and when she said, I absolutely love it. It is the first time I have stuck with a program for this long, and I'm seeing results in my strength, stamina, and actual weight loss. And that took me by surprise. Not by surprise that she loved it and that she's getting results, but by surprise that she's stuck with this program uh, for any program for, for a long time. I know, I know that she's done uh, several other ones, but I had no clue that she maybe stopped or went to a different program. And so that got me thinking. I'm like, you know, I think I'm going to reach out to the people. I'm, 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 I belong to a, a various groups, uh, one group specific for 80-Day Obsession, another group everybody's kind of doing their own thing. Some are doing 80-Day Obsession in there. Um, and then just a few other people that I was just intrigued that uh, maybe are in my city that are doing that program that I reached out to. And I'm like, you know, I, I think I can share some of these things with people. What is it that that has you loving this workout program? Even my wife is, is really kind of fired up about it. And when I was uh, talking to her, you know, I'm asking her, what, what what is it that that you love about it? And so I'm just going to kind of, as I got to collecting uh, people's feedback, it kind of broke down into a few categories. And so I'm going to share some of those. I'm also going to share some of my experience with it because to tell you the truth, I was pretty skeptical at first and I almost decided not to do the program. You know, I'm kind of this uh, bring on the weights, the heavy weights and bring on, you know, uh, some pull-ups and push-ups and stuff like that. But I've been greatly impressed with this program and what I've been able to accomplish and how it's greatly tested me. So, um, so one of the things that people absolutely are loving. Um, well, well, first of all, maybe I should back up for those of you that don't know what eighty day obsession is. It's it's a it's a full body transformation program, and it's eighty unique workouts. Now, while some of the workouts and some of the moves are similar from week to week or or um yeah from from week to week it's broken down to three phases so it always switches up every phase and but the workouts were filmed 80 80 different ones um so while you might be doing a lunge in week one and the same type of lunge in week two the, it was recorded differently, so the motivation's different. The the people in the cast are are mixed up, and 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 you get to progress right along with this cast. So I'm, I might be getting ahead of myself here, but there's 80 unique workouts, and it's time nutrition eating. It's it's it is a, a workout program by Autumn Calabrese, the lady that did Country Heat and 21 Day Fix and Hammer and Chisel. Um, and the focus, and maybe this is where I was a bit skeptical at first, um, you've got ab workouts, arm workouts, leg workouts, and butt workouts. And as I was looking for the you know, the beginning, I don't, I don't know, maybe the advertisement for it, it looked to me, and you know, I, I was kind of pigeonholing it and saying, you know what, this is probably more for the ladies. You know, It's probably not for me. And then I stepped back and I remembered when I did hammer and chisel and I got some crazy results from that program. Autumn's workouts in that program 
almost, I mean, seemed to just be relentlessly challenging and greatly made me step up my game. And I became curious on this one. I'm like, I wonder if I'm going to have to step up my game. I know I'll be doing workouts a little bit differently. I know that they'll be using these little resistance loops that you put around your legs or your ankles. And, you know, for a second there, I thought, oh, gosh, that's that doesn't sound like me. And, and you're using some fitness sliders. But I remembered using those in Pio and being a great challenging work on the core. And so I'm like, you know, who doesn't want to, you know, work on their arms, work on their legs, have great abs. And, you know, if, if, if the butt workouts are going to make uh, make jeans feel, fit a little better. Why not? I, I I can challenge myself for 80 days. So that's how I jumped in. And so here's the feedback that people gave. Um, one is variety. People are digging the variety. There's new workouts and challenges every day. Um, there's something new and you don't get that repeat effect. I know a lot of times in our programs that we've had before, you tend to start repeating the same jokes or the same, you know, the same um maybe motivational quote or something like that. You just know when it's going to happen after you've done a few weeks of it because you've repeated that workout a couple times. This one, you know what? 80 days, 90 days will pass by. And if somebody remembers what was quoted in day one, that's pretty impressive. Um, But for the most part, it's not going to happen. So you got that variety. Uh, You don't get bored. And uh, the, the one, um, the lady I was talking to, she says, you know, I love that every day is different and she changes it up. She changes it up each month. That's, uh, that's autumn calories. And that helps keep me, it ca- helps keep me interested and motivated as well as it's helped me lose weight. So that's it. I mean, th- th- you're building consistency and you're seeing the results from it. I think for a lot of people, Sometimes we see these 21-day programs, and that those can get you some results, but sometimes people just look at that as, after day 21, I'm totally done, um, or I don't want to repeat that again because I've already done it, and so that's that's the refreshing part, the variety. The next thing that people talked about was format. Uh, the fact that it's three phases, I think maybe phase one is maybe about 26 days, and the next one's, I don't know. <laughs> However, it gets broken down. Uh, I don't. I don't think it's like twenty six, twenty six, twenty six. But um, uh, however, the, each phase is broken down, close to thirty days each. Um, but each phase. Uh, wh- what's kind of cool here is, and, and I'm, uh, for those of you on video, I'm, I'm holding up four fingers here. Week one will. Each week is in that phase might be similar moves, but you'll be doing fifteen reps in week one. And then do doing two uh, sets of those. In week two, you'll do 10, 10 reps uh, with three sets in there. And then another, the next week is three sets with 10 reps. But the way it's configured is a little bit differently. And then the fourth week will be 15 by two again. But it's configured a little bit differently. Um, so it, it does keep the body guessing. Uh, I think that's muscle confusion that's kicking in. I think that's why people see seeing such great results. Each phase, the moves increase in complexity as you get stronger. And for me, I thought I was I'm really liking the innovative compound moves uh, that that'll happen. You're not just doing squats, but you might be uh, in a sumo squat doing some bicep curls at the same time. <laughs> and so uh, really challenging, not only holding some heavy weights there, but but doing the arm workout, too. Uh, people really commented on this other thing. They they commented on the cast. Those are the people that are working out, out in the on the set along with uh, with Autumn. They said Autumn and the cast they they make you feel part of a group. Uh, my wife said you know it really felt like you're part of a live class, which I thought thought is cool. These workouts, by the way, uh, they're they're. Uh, easily streamed within Beachbody On Demand. They're not available on DVD, so you aren't going to get like 80 workouts on DVD. Can you imagine the kit that would have been on? Um, but they, they also uh, people also talked about the engagement with the group and the encouragement you get. And you get to experience what the other people on the set are are experiencing. For instance, they started their day one the same time you're starting your day one. When they're sore on their day 20 because they did leg day, 
you can totally relate because you just got done with leg day two and you're feeling the same thing. You're, you're getting to um, basically have the transformation right along with the cast. So that's a great thing. Um, and each week, this is kind of a cool thing they do in On Demand. Each week they do this thing called Weekly Obsession and the cast will share their experiences, their challenges, their victories in a separate video that, that's just made for that. So you know what to expect the following upcoming week. And Autumn kind of just kind of preps you on wh what to expect. So the team, you know, just Autumn's team and how she coaches you through the moves is one of the another one of those things that people love. Um, the, another thing that people commented on was the eating plan. Uh, it's timed nutrition, so that tells you what to eat and when in in the right amount of containers or the right amount of portions, I guess I should say, for uh, what your goals are. So. Uh, people have said their eating habits have improved. Uh, they've learned uh, how their body uses food as fuel. Uh, the time nutrition has helped them balance out. Um, well, not everybody, but this, this one person said the time nutrition helped her balance out her blood sugar levels. And she loved the uh, time nutrition because although it was challenging at first, learning how to eat at the right times has now become a habit for her. So uh, really, really great feedback there. One person did comment about the challenge group. Uh, that's one of the things that I'm running. Uh, we, we run it through uh, an app on our phone just to check in for accountability. But uh, this lady said, you know, I really like the accountability, especially when it's done in conjunction with a challenge group because she, I don't want to fall behind. I'm definitely finding the time to get the workouts in. Uh, and before this program, it was just too easy to skip the workout because we weren't all doing the same thing. I have to agree. You know, it's kind of something really kind of cool about being a part of a group and, and, and going through a program all at once. And, you know, people are like, ah, who's feeling it yesterday from the abs, <laughs> ab workout? And everybody's like, yeah, me too. Uh, you know, I know sometimes people started a little bit different time. And sometimes, you know, the flu has gone around taking people out of the game for a week or so. But you know what? We can all relate to leg day or we can all relate to this uh, um uh, one called total body core. I mean, it, we know what, what the moves are going to be or what a butt kicker of a workout program is. I even had one person tell me, she goes, you know what? I can't believe how strong I feel. And if I would have, if I would have seen these moves that I'm doing now before we started the group, she goes, I probably would have never started the workouts. In other words, she cannot believe how strong she is and what she's able to do because of this program. It, it, it progressively keeps you moving in a great direction. It keeps challenging you. Yes, there is a person modifying on the screen, but you're watching her get stronger as well. Initially, she's starting off and she's kind of having to hold herself up on this chair and balance and all this stuff. By phase three, she's like, doing moves without that chair, without the need for that assistance. Um, and I think that will happen for you too. If, you, if you're finding yourself, you're, you're at that very beginning part. These moves are challenging. It, it is a challenging, challenging workout. But man, the, the just the energy and the results that people are getting is off the charts. I can't wait. We, we're not done with our 80 days yet. This is, I, I think today, as of this recording, we just finished day 60. <laughs> so we've got 20 more days to go. But what people have reported to me is they feel stronger. Uh, they've got, they're getting serious muscle gain. Confidence is off the charts. Uh, they're seeing results. This person shared her results with me. She says she's down 15 pounds and 17 inches in the first 55 days. Um, who wouldn't want results like that? <laughs> Unless you don't have a lot of weight to lose. Um, and the other person said, you know, uh, I, I, like I said, at the beginning of this podcast, the lady um, told me that she goes, I, I've never stuck with a program before. And that's what I'm doing now. And I'm actually... My endurance is better. My strength is better. I'm losing weight. And you know, I, I'm guessing their clothing is better. They seem happier. And I'm watching these posts every day. And while people are posting pictures and selfies of themselves being exhausted or being challenged, 
I'm also seeing a glow about them. I'm seeing a boost of confidence. I'm seeing a, yes, I'm doing this. I can't believe it. I'm, I'm conquering this. I'm, I'm seeing that with more and more of the challenges that maybe I haven't, haven't always seen in the past. I see a lot of people start programs, but sticking with it and staying with it and um, coming back and saying, look at the results I've gotten. Man, it, it, it's been a few groups, uh, a few programs that I've been a part of that it's been a while since I've seen people stick with that. Is it because of the 80 days? Is it because of the nutrition? Is it because of the variety of workouts? Is it because of where it focuses? Or is it because of the motivation and the encouragement? Is it because of the challenge group and the support and motivation we give to people and fist bump and high five and relate and pick people up when they're struggling? I think it's all of that. And what a great combination. I know for a lot of people, we want to start small. We want to let ourselves off the hook before we even start. So we say, oh, maybe I'll just do 10 minutes. Maybe I'll just get out and walk around the block. Maybe I'll do that. And for for people that are doing absolutely nothing, that's a great start. But for those people that are like, you know, I really, I, I need to get some results. I need to do this. And I don't want to do something that just I'm going to be bored with. This may be your program. This may be the thing that you jump into and just follow it along and just trust the process. Now, for me, I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest. I it looked like it was all for ladies there, but there are two guys that are on set. Um, so I, I, I've been watching their transformation along the way. And while, yeah, I'm not doing major pull ups and stuff like that. There are challenging moves. The the the, the core moves. Uh, I, actually, all the moves are are, are pretty challenging. Um, it just may not be where I'm grabbing constant dumbbells and doing major curls and shoulder presses and pull-ups and push-ups. But a lot of those moves are in there that focus on the entire body. So I cannot uh, I cannot walk away and say, you know what, I didn't get challenged today. Because if I walk away from the, any of those workouts and say I didn't get challenged, I didn't put in the effort. Um, and I'm going to tell you what, most of those workouts by the middle, I'm, I'm just like, I put those loops on and then I'm like, oh my gosh, I thought this would be so simple and I'm, I'm going to reduce the resistance next time because I want to make it through all the moves or there'll be those times where it's like, you know what? I really went too light on the weights. I am upping it up and really going for it next time. So you can challenge yourself the whole way. It's been a very different set of workouts and set of compound moves that I have not done before. I mean, if you get stuff like squats and lunges and and uh, shoulder presses and stuff like that, but while you're doing a different move at the same time, uh, maybe you're holding a squat, but you're doing some shoulder press thing. I think today there was there was one where we're we're sitting down, laying on our back, and then we're pushing the weight up in the air and pushing up on the other arm, and then flipping around into a push up, and then doing a little push up area, and then flipping back around. I mean, it's like oh my gosh, there was a lot of thought that needed to go into making that move work. And after ten reps, I was I was spent. So it's been great to to do those things. I'm I'm great, greatly humbled, and it's helped me. Um, it's helped me just kind of just get geared up and pumped up for these for lo- longer workouts. These are longer workouts that I haven't done in a long time. Um, usually, like thirty to forty minutes has been kind of my zone lately, and these push sixty minutes. Uh, some of them. And that's kind of got me leading into wanting to do another round of P90X, uh, which I which I am going to do. Um, but man, I've just been so fired up about 80 Day Obsession. Uh, I'm excited with I'm I'm feeling stronger. I'm feeling like uh, my endurance has gone a lot lot better, and I, I like the results. It, it's been great. So um, hopefully you uh, hopefully you'll consider doing this program we are going to uh, get another group together and uh you know what you don't have to wait until that 80 day group if you want to jump in on the group now and then jump in that next group and you want to start your 80 days you're welcome to it you, you can message me at perry tinsley at gmail.com and i'll get you the information 
but uh, right within on demand. And you know what the other cool thing is for the for people that aren't sure if they want to commit to the 80 days, there is a five day version. They're 30 minute workouts. So do we call it five day obsession? No, the, the it's called a little obsessed and it gives you a taster of all the different types of workouts, all the different, um, uh, moves in within those workouts. And it's just five days. You can repeat that a few times. It's a great one, uh, to, to get started. And that may give you a great flavor. It's all within beach body on demand. I'll post a link here in the show notes so you can check it out. But that's the reason why people are loving their top reasons why they're loving 80 day obsession. To tell you the truth, I haven't heard anybody (laughs) really have any complaints about it. Um, I I think if there's any complaint, it probably has to do with the loops. um, Because when you're pulling on the loops a lot and you're trying to string them across your you know, feet sometimes, sometimes those, those loops don't last forever and they will, you know, may tend to tear or snap or whatever. And you have to get extra ones, but really that's about the only thing that I think I have heard. And maybe just the time nutrition and the nutrition just takes some planning. But once you get that down, um, that that's it. And if you're committing to, to yourself and wanting to get the results, then you do what it takes to make that happen. And I think, I think this, this workout, this program helps people set aside the excuses and just says, you know what, I'm keeping up with everybody else. I'm doing this for me and I'm sticking with it and let's go for it. And they're learning a lot of things along the way. That's what I wish for you, my friend. That's all I have for this week. I so appreciate you for subscribing, for listening, and uh, you know, even considering just your own fitness program. Even if it's not for the 80 days, there's a lot of workout programs that we have out there um, that can fit any person, fitness personality type and uh, help people just get results to live healthy, fulfilling lives. Because what we're wanting to do is not just to get fit so we can just sit on our butts all day and not do anything for the rest of it. It enables us to do a lot more awesome things in our life when we get in daily exercise, whether it's 10 minutes, 25 minutes, or even up to an hour uh, workout and constantly challenging yourself to just get a little bit better than the day before. That's what I wish for you. That's what our goal is. I so appreciate you for coming on here. If you found this value, valuable at all, please share it. Uh, share this podcast. Just click the little share link and, uh, and, and send it to somebody you know and love that could really benefit from this and uh, get more information about this program. And if you do get over into your podcast app or into iTunes, I would so appreciate a a rating and review. That would be really, really cool. It helps reach more people. That's all I have for this week. You absolutely rock, my friend. Remember, it's never too late. We'll see you next week.